Good morning. It is very early this morning. We're getting up to go fishing. But for breakfast, look what we're having. So I bought this oatmeal the other day and the two bananas. You saw that. So I'm going to pack us a breakfast. I've got a little stove in my backpack. We're going to have some oatmeal on the trail with these two bananas. <laughs> and so I'm going to just pack that. And got some butter, some honey, oatmeal, oh, and some half and half in this cranberry juice bottle. So I'll pack that. Instead of packing a lunch, we're packing breakfast. Let's go fishing. So we're on the river fishing again today. Deborah's caught one. I think I've caught two, but I didn't, mine weren't, I never landed them. Deborah landed hers, so we have one fish in our possession. Beautiful day. I'm getting hungry now. I'm going to cook some oatmeal and um, see how that goes. Okay, it's on. It's starting to boil a little bit. Put the lid on it. Now she moved down there. Here comes her bobber. It's white. Right there is where I get them. Where I hit. Can you see that shaking? <laughs> I think we're gonna have a rapid boil. What didn't mean to catch? Oh, we do. Didn't mean to get that hot. Uh, yeah. Ooh. Let's back to the action. Oh, she had one in it. <laughs> That's what I've done twice today. I just can't land it. It's like, what is up with that? Something. My honey is a little bit congealed, so I'm just going to put it in the water to melt it. Oh, let's take it off the thing so I don't... Just make it sugar water, and then we'll add the oat, some this water to the oatmeal. Okay, I poured a little bit of oats. This is a MRE. <laughs> Here's homemade MRE. So put a little bit of the oatmeal in there, a little bit of the sugar water. Let's put some butter in there. A little bit of butter. And a little bit of half and half. So there is seal it up. And there's your oatmeal. I'm just gonna let that sit for a little bit, thicken up a little bit. Scrumptious, frugalicious. Mmm. <laughs> oatmeal. What is it sweetened with? Honey. It is so good. Honey, um, butter, and half and half. So good. You can't get any better out here than oh. having breakfast on the river. Fishing. Fishing. In cool temps at a high mountain range. I know. Homemade MRE. Yeah. So good. Got the dishes done. I've got to get back to fishing. Put that in there. Where's my stove? Oh. Oops. Oops. 
stove bag. Pack it in, pack it out. Well, I lost my indicator. It's not too far. I'm thinking I'm going to take off my boots and go get it. No. Oh, what about all the huts and stuff? I know. Look how far down I went. I know. It's just ooey gooey. You be careful. I don't think I want to do it. <laughs> I don't blame you. I mean, look how far. I know, that's not safe. I thought it was going to be. Um... Your, bear, your bear spray was going to take a swim. So bye bye, bye bye, Bobbin indicator. Yeah. I'd rather have my waders on if I'm going to do that. I ain't going to do it. I went way deep. I mean, look at my pants. I had them <laughs> up over my knees. Yeah. Oh, we'll have to go back and get our waders. Just so you know, I want y'all to look around here. You need to be aware of your surroundings at all times. Because we are in bear country. That would be bear scat. I actually stepped in it. <laughs> it was a bigger pile earlier, but that's where I've been fishing. As you know, I lost my bobber. But it is bear country. It's honey bear. Not really. It is bear country. We are in bear country. And I did bring honey bear for our oatmeal this morning. But when you are in bear country, don't forget bear spray. Have I told you that story about me forgetting bear spray and had a bear encounter? I should put that video up by itself so I can reference it. But anyway, I carry this on my hip. I just took it off right now to do this video. But um, always be aware that you are in bear country. Did you catch anything? No. Well, you got all the equipment. You look good. <laughs> look at her net. She's got a new net. For my birthday from Jana and some fishing equipment that I'm using today. Yeah. Yeah, we've been wanting a net like that. The other ones, the hooks get in them <laughs> too easy and you fight the hook more than you do the fish so anyway mine's already got a hole in it from cutting the fish out of it <laughs> oh really yeah oh i didn't know that well not this one not the oh one the other one me. okay my old one. Oh gosh no no i know i was like really sorry <laughs> all right i think we're calling it a day it's about 11 30 fish quit biting let's go Back upstream.